Okay, this is part two of 9670 Southeast Eidelman Street. I was able to locate the camera and I was exactly where the previous inspector uh, was then able to advance any further. And uh, I just marked the depth up and then took some photos of the previous marks as well. So I'm going to recommend, um, as I'm pulling back here, you're going to see there's quite a bit of standing water in the pipe. So there's definitely uh, not a lot of slope and grade in the pipe. Uh, so I'm going to recommend correcting the slope in the grade and then also installing a clean out pretty much where the marks are and then um, re-scope and re-evaluate all the way to the street, determine if the entire line needs to be replaced or um, just a section that's bellied out. This is all underwater here. Uh, it's a fairly shallow line coming out of the house so there's just not a lot of fall and over the years it's settled and it's just holding a bunch of water here so definitely recommend repairing it and correcting the uh, slope and grade. Okay, so it finally comes out, but from uh, 37 feet to 63 feet is completely bellied out. We'll see if that's the, uh, the rest of the way is drained out on our way back. It's cast iron pipe, but cast iron uh, doesn't have an issue. It's the slope of the grade and draining out. So everything's looking good as we pull back to the house. Uh, we have over a 25 foot uh, belly on the side of the house that I'm going to recommend repairing and then uh, and then install clean out or while the trench is open during the repair continue to camera onto the street and determine if the whole way through the yard is bellied out or if it uh, ends up draining and functioning properly the rest of the way.